Hey everybody, Tim here for a Drunk Nerd video. Lower Decks, Season 2, Episode 8, I Excretus. So, as you can tell, Naked Time video! It's Naked Time! Oh. I'm, I was so happy. So I get off work at like midnight, come home, start the episode, I was over the mood. I was laughing so hard, so loud, I woke everybody up. I mean, it's not very often you get a Naked Time video. I said long time ago, like anytime there's naked in the title of an episode, I will do the episode naked. 2,000 videos later, I've only done like the Naked Now, or Naked Time and Naked Now, and that's it. And technically, as I've already said, the title is I Excretus, but they talk about the Naked Time so much that I was like, fuck it, I don't even care. I've been drinking. They have to watch it, not me. I don't care. Overall, I, I thought it was a really funny episode. I was so, like, I just laughed so much. So, the the overall plot is great. Just, like, the ship needs to be evaluated. And that's it. And I was like, okay. I mean, that seems really simple. The opening scene's, like, great. Where they just accidentally leave for, like, six hours. A view like this makes you realize it doesn't matter what deck you work on. We're all in it together. And they left us. They left us. How much oxygen do we have? A lot? A little? Ballpark? That could be a thing. Like, if I was a captain, that'd, that'd probably happen. I mean, it's a distress call. The lives of the many outweigh the lives of the few. So they have to save those people. Forget the, the four people that we left. Whatever. So, overall, the crew have to go through several different tests. Most of them are very familiar and very comical. Like, we get the Mirror Universe, which I am so sick of the Mirror Universe. It was great in the original series. We don't see it in the next generation, but we do see it in Deep Space Nine multiple times. And technically, we don't see it in Voyager. But what's funny is the next generation in Voyager, we kind of do see it, though. Anyway, then all of season one of Discovery is nothing but Mirror Universe. And I'm like, I'm so fucking sick of this. So as soon as we saw it, I was like, oh, I don't know about this. But they, they did make it funny, so I was okay. The old Western Hollow program, which is, an, again, a Next Generation shout-out. We see the Wrath of Khan, where it's like, oh, you can't go in there. It's radiation. And he, like, burns his hand. He's like, oh, fuck. So I, I love stuff like that. Like, the little references really, really made me laugh. So that was great. Uh, and then, of course, the Borg, which we haven't really, like, I'm granted this is after Voyager. So the Borg aren't really a thing right now. They're not really a threat because Janeway got rid of them. And then finally, when we get to the naked time, so much skin of so much of the crew. Oh my God. I, I loved it. I was laughing so hard. As I already said, I was waking people up. It was great. As we continue and we, we realize everything was rigged and they're like, well, I guess we got to fix everything. It, the shout outs, they just keep coming where we get like the crystalline entity, which let's be realistic the most boring character from the next generation only shows up twice the pilot episode of the next generation and then once again like one of the lore episodes but i was like oh my god and they're like oh look a crystalline entity eating a planet a crist two crystalline entities getting frisky i was like why <laughs> why are they making such a big deal like stop it's a bad character but i was like whatever uh, we do see the Borg Queen, which I'm always curious about stuff like that because we know the Borg Queen is also coming back in Season 2 of Picard. Like, does, do the creators of Lower Decks know that? Like, was that like a, a forced joke to kind of get ready? Or is that just a coincidence? So I'm always curious about stuff like that. But it was, it was fun regardless to see the Borg Queen and poor Boimler going from 100% all the way down because they're like you gotta stall it was it was very very sad and boimler borg that that was that's where the i excretus comes from but i oh, god i loved it i was so happy with this episode y'all have no idea so i'm curious what other people think so many jokes so many references what did i miss uh go ahead 
Thank you guys for commenting. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. And I cannot wait to see you guys next time.